Ah, oh, man. Well, it's, uh, it's time. I chose the Super Nintendo version. Sorry. But it's just, listen, I recognize the GBA version. Some might think it's superior with the soundtrack because David Wise composed it. I get it. I get it. I've heard the soundtrack. It's good. However, the nostalgia for me is with this version of the game. And I do understand that the Game Boy Advance version has extra levels. I get it. It's considered definitive. But I'm going to experience what I experienced as a kid. So that was my decision to make. In future, maybe we can do the GBA version. If you are interested in that, let it be known in comments. And I mean it. Because <laughs> that's the only way I'm going to consider it. Anyway, with that out of the way. I had to crank up the volume because there's a little bit of a difference. Um, right. Well. I had to delete, uh, one of my brother's save files, so... Listen, they... They didn't... They never finished games as children. They never did. <laughs> Alright. They really, they really didn't, like, it wasn't until they were teenagers where they started finishing games and me and my other brother would, would make fun of it. Hello there, it's me, Mrs. Wrinkly Kong. I found life too hectic at school, with all those naughty crumblings pestering me all the time. If you need to save your game, Dixie, call me here anytime. And I'll record your progress on my new vidme what's it machine thing. Anyway. What's that? You want to see The Lost World? Which channel is that on, Dixie? Uh, and yeah, this thing showed the N64, which at the time was either about to come out or had come out, but the development of this game was a bit strange because, uh, well, it came out at a time where the focus was shifted to the Nintendo 64. I can't remember if I don't think there's anything to do here. Right, yeah. Hello there, young Dixie. My name is... My name's Bazaar, and this is my general store. All of my brothers are scattered over these islands. Pop in and say hello if you meet them on your travel. Okay. Where's the shell from? Is there a mirror? Yeah. I need all of this stuff. This shell was found at the bottom of Lake Orangatanga, and is pretty rare. At five bear coins, it's a bargain. Gotta be joking. Alright, we'll, we'll leave. We'll come back. If you like bears, you're gonna love this game. Anyway, this, this game gets uh, a lot of flack. But here's the thing, I didn't know about this flack <laughs> until way later. Um, I told the story of, uh, you know, my experience with Donkey Kong when I was playing Donkey Kong Country and 2, but I'll, I'll tell it again because, you know, separate VOD. He may be a toddler, but, oh yeah, right, yeah. And if you throw him, his humongous body can smash through the floor of some areas, trust me. Growth Hormone Kong. I, I did not like Kitty, and I'm sure most people did, didn't either. Is it Kitty or is it Baby? I can't remember, but... Yeah. I don't know why they couldn't put Donkey Kong. I think a, a, a game with Dixie and DK would have been awesome. Anyway. Alright, so... I should have been reading there, but it's okay. By the way, the confirm button on this is B. This is in the era where they could not make up their minds, so I've been constantly pressing A, but it's B in this game. Oh, that's gonna come back later. When I'm playing Zelda tomorrow. 
Yeah. That's gonna... that's gonna be a thing. Yeah, I don't know, like... To me, I, I have nostalgia for this soundtrack, but... I know that some people do not like it. <laughs> it's just... Not the... not their... their cup of tea. But anyway, like, childhood obesity. Breaking through stuff. A mechanic. So yeah, uh... I had this game. Growing up, this was the Donkey Kong we had. So... I played Donkey Kong Country 2 at a... A family friend's house. So they had it. And, uh... Played it for like about half an hour, thought it was really cool. So you know, afterwards... We asked our dad, hey, can you, can you get us this game? And he saw us having fun with it, so he was like, yeah. I'll go buy you it. So cool. Whenever we had the money next, um, he went to buy it. And we were so excited. He came back home and he's like, boys, guess what? They had the new one. Instead of Donkey Kong Country 2, we got I got you Donkey Kong Country 3. And you know, us being kids, we were happy, man. It was just, oh shit, we got the latest one? That's awesome. That's like the third one. And you know, we played it, we enjoyed it. Still didn't like, you know, Baby Kong or whatever the- whatever his name is, but... This game was great. Loved it. <laughs> it's in hindsight now that, you know... I- I am- I am aware. I am aware of the reputation of this one. And why people don't like it. But, for me, man, this was Donkey Kong for me. And, you know, I only played Donkey Kong Country 2 a couple weeks back for the first time, so... That was a fun experience, and I do recognize why that one is considered, you know, the peak of the trilogy. I, I do understand that. But, man, I hear this music, it's nostalgia. And as much as much as I as much as I love this game, I know I know it's going to make me salty. I know I'm going to get unreasonably angry at it later. So I just want you to know that when you do watch this and I start saying stuff, like I don't know, I hate this fucking game, it comes from a place of love, chat. It's not that I actually hate the game. <laughs> Let it be known. Um, okay, cool. And I did like that this one had proper progress tracking. Poor Kitty Kong hasn't been featured in another Donkey Kong Country game. Kinda just vanished. I mean, how could you not like this track? Alright, we have enough for the seashell. I will be 100%ing it as it might take a bit of an extra effort to do, but it's fine. I have to, you know? Oh, see? If I was to ask chat now, like, to rank the DK series... I know, I know what the answer is, that's why I don't want to ask it, because it's just like, well... You can't switch a minute, can you? Hang on. I forgot how you do this. I think, do I have to yeet Deluxe Kong? No. I think it's just a, a specific angle. There we go. Yeah, it works. He grows up and leaves his family to move to Banana City. What, kitty? What do you mean? You know, if he had a voice, 
we're talking, you know, terrible 1990s cartoon show, Kitty Kong would be like, Oh, hello, Governor, what's this, what's this? You have a bit of a voice like this. Oh, very simple voice. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> It'd be some British dude voicing. You know it would be. Hi, Dixie! Platform, please. I can't remember... No, it's not here. I'm going off very vague recollections, you know? <laughs> he owns a bar now? Ah. Well, as long as he's doing well for himself. What was even weirder was when I heard that Donkey Kong 64 did not feature really any Kong from the previous games except DK and Diddy, and then they just introduced two new Kongs. Like, I thought they would have just stuck to these two. I thought they just redesigned Dixie when I saw that game and then found out later, oh, it's, it's not actually her. Crap, I may have missed. I forgot, I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. What's this, what's this? I need to be going in the, oh no, it's just standard. I, I overcomplicated it, I thought it was a secret. I messed up, I gotta do the stage again. <laughs> DK coin. I forgot. Yeah, I gotta go back in. But the uh, the bonus stages are done. You know what? I'm happy there are people here that haven't played any of the Donkey Kong games, because now now their experience is going to be, oh yeah, I saw DK3 on the Super Nintendo being played first, and then they won't associate the GBA soundtrack. I mean, look, I, I understand there's, there's things in that soundtrack that definitely sound superior, but admittedly because the Super Nintendo just has better audio quality, it's kind of hard. If it had the same audio quality as the Super Nintendo, no question. The GBA soundtrack would be better. It's... I think in spirit, the songs are better, it's just the audio quality is, is terrible. That being said, um, the analog pocket, the thing that I'm using to play Game Boy games, it does seem to do a pretty good job with the audio, like it has some feature, I don't know how it works, but... It seems to enhance the audio, so it sounds a bit cleaner. I don't know what it does. But it, it's like in the settings, it's enhanced audio. And yeah, I mean, it sounds pretty clean to me. So we'll see. When I listened to the soundtrack, it was only YouTube rips, so they weren't great by any means. But I got the gist of it. Uh, Deluxe Kong, this would have been fine, I would have gotten the coin. There we go. Now we get the one up either way.
<laughs> the struggle of having to find a safe point. Also, I love this rendition of Mario 64. Sometimes I play it as like a, a BRB track and people get confused like, wait, where is this from? Well, maybe if you play Donkey Kong Country 3, the superior of the series, you might know. <laughs> I'm gonna keep memeing on that. Chat, this literally spelt Babby. Babby! Babby game! <laughs> okay, now I, I believe I purchased the seashell. I might be wrong, pretty certain. No, like B-A-A-B-Y. I gotta listen to that song as well. I like Funky's theme in this. This shell was found at the level. Blah, 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 blah. Give me it, thank you. It's a deal. Hope you're very happy together. Hey, you just have a really nice day now, Kongs. You here? <laughs> just could have, could not believe the amount of bears that were in this game. Aha, uh -huh, yeah, what we're needing is some sort of spare part situation, you dig? I hope I'm right. It may have been the mirror. I know it's one of these two. Yeah, it's a shell. Cool. Hello there, how's it going, Kongs? Barnacles, my name, and I've set up home here to build a collection. This bird is a friendly fellow, isn't he? He flew in once, and so I decided to keep him. I gotta read quicker. What a beautiful shell. It's just what I need to finish off my collection. Me collection. Say, Kongs, would you swap that shell for my bird? Uh, I have no attachment to this bird at all. Fuck this bird. <laughs> you would? That's great. Here's the bird. Please take care of him. Just love how quickly gives up the bird for just a shell. A living creature for a shell. Just so materialistic, that bear. It's like, dude, it's a living creature. That thing probably loves you. Got attached to you. And you're just gonna give it up like that? Oh! I'm sorry. It's just you compare this to Donkey Kong Country 1, and the sound effects, the, sometimes they're subtle, and sometimes it's that, but in this one, like, pretty much everything is. Argh! Argh! Oh, no. It begins. Welcome to hell. These barrels are really, really going to, uh, yeah. Test my patience later. <laughs> I was really happy to see On Guard.
now he has bananas. Can't remember if there was anything else. I don't think there was. Oh, well, that's fine. Just repeat it. <laughs> I'm surprised that didn't happen the first time, to be honest. I just went with muscle memory. And it worked. How to get in there? Oh wait! Ah, oh, shit! I got off. I know, I know, I know. See, this is something that wasn't explained, but I know how to do it. Um, hang on. There is a way to reset it without starting the stage again. At this point, I may as well, but it's fine. Um, just do the on guard thing again. That should respawn everything. We'll see how it goes with this playthrough, because I was watching, uh, I mean, yeah. I was watching a streamer that I follow play this, and a couple of times, more than a couple of times, it was just the question was raised, why are you playing this version of the game instead of the GBA version? I suppose it's for the best, it's like I got five coins. Alright, so the way this one works... Ooh, I haven't, I haven't done this in a long time. I... No. Fuck. You gotta do a skipping stone thing with him. I just have not done it in a very long time. It's such a weird mechanic. I don't... I don't have to ever explain it in-game, but... I need to practice it first. I have not done this in a very long time. Sorry, the stage must take a little bit extra. There it is. There it is. Okay, it's, it's that. That's what I need to do. I bet the in-game explanation is just a bunch of bananas. <laughs> I just tell you to do it. You're gonna be sick of this bonus stage by the time we're done with this stage. I wish it was a, a little less harsh. That the birds would respawn leaving the screen, but. Yeah, there's, there's just no way to retry it. It's just... You missed! Go! 
Either start the stage again or backtrack and go through the barrel. I should be playing as Dixie, just so I don't lose, uh, yeah, the hard requirement. I know. Stage four? Stage four. And it's already throwing this at me. On the bright side, they'll, they'll have coins. Is it really a case that Dixie can't do it? <sighs> I, just, I don't want to try and... Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> I might have to try it with Dixie now. Or just finish the stage and just, yeah, come back. Unfortunately, it's 100% that you need to get every bonus stage. It's just, it's a thing. What I need is a sandbox. I need a sandbox to be able to practice it in without risk of losing. I did it once. I can't believe I did it once. <laughs> when it really counts, I can't do it. I'm just gonna... Ah, oh, damn it. I was trying to die on purpose. Wow, chat, look at how many lives I have. Right, I'll tell you what, if I don't get it this time, I'll just, uh... I'll do one more attempt with Kitty. And then I'll try with Dixie, and if I don't get it, then I'll just come back to it. It's easy to tell what I haven't done anyway. Because it, it does mark it, thankfully. No, you know what, I'll try Dixie first. Oh, just. Alright, she makes it. But the in I think the intended way is to do the skipping stone thing. Fuck! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, it's okay, it's okay. It's, it's not cruel. It's not cruel. <laughs> it's not cruel. You see, it's, it's nice. It's a good game. It's a good game. All right, we can move on now. With this level of padding of 20 lives. 21 lives. Okay, if you could have like the ultimate duo, which duo would you have? For me, it'd be it'd be Dixie and Donkey Kong. That would be my duo. I got the DK coin, right? I'm pretty sure I did. Yes. Okay. That's all good. Skidaz roll. <laughs> There's nothing here? Okay, sometimes there's stuff there. No, 
at least get through this first world <laughs> without any problems. Whatever, it works. Oh no. This might be bad. Okay. Generous time. Visually for a Super Nintendo game, this is pretty damn nice looking. Wait. No, okay. One day I'll, I'll play some Sega Genesis games. I've always been curious. It's the one system I haven't really experienced at all. Probably shouldn't have done that, but it's just for it, you know, no, no nightmare here. This is just <laughs> to get through the stage. All right, and then I can press start and select if I mess up. That's the beauty of it. But I will do it again. You would take Lanky and Candy Kong. I mean, I guess in a, in a fantasy where you could pick any. I meant, like, out of the ones that have been playable. I guess Lanky has been, but Candy? If I play Sega, can I play the Lion King game? I, you know, I know one of the Disney games. I can't remember which one, but one of them is Notorious. For a, uh... A reason. I can't remember why, but I feel like... I remember one of them just being something that's like suffering of the highest order. But I don't remember why or which one. Maybe I'm imagining it. Um, it would depend how cheap I could pick it up because I do try to play, um, you know, original copies of the game and experience it with the real hardware. Where possible. Lanky and Diddy, okay. I mean, obviously, Sonic is, like, up there, because I just haven't, um, played any of those games. But then, you know, I've heard good things about, um, Rocket Knight Adventures. That's supposed to be a very good game. Although, you know, one of those titles that I don't think I could realistically pick up. As it is, uh, because it's fun, it's just stupidly expensive to get a, a copy of it on eBay. It's a 
kid you had the hardest time with the monkeys and the ostriches in the Lion King game. It might be the one I'm thinking of. I just remember, I can't rem- <sighs> I heard about it somewhere. Just one of the Disney games. There's like a discrepancy between the Sega Genesis and the Super Nintendo version. And it's like one of them is better, but is harder or something along those lines. I, I don't remember specifically what it is, but I just remember to approach Disney interactive games with like an air of caution. I don't think they ever... There's some controls for the elephant that just aren't obvious unless you know. But yeah, I mean, it won't be for a while. It's just... Try again. I've been trying to make edited content for YouTube, and I think one of the things I want to explore is kind of... Just playing through an old game and just talking about it. After the fact. Of course, have the stream be, you know, where I get all the footage and shit, but... As well as any moments that I could clip into it. Jeez. This is a weird one, as long as the elephant doesn't see the rats, everything is fine, but the moment you see the rats, that's where it's bad. Apparently Disney told the developers to make the game difficult, that people wouldn't be able to beat it during the rental period for that game. Uh, yeah. Because a lot of that, those games did end up as rentals. That makes sense. I remember we have to do these stages. Hello, would you believe it? Hello, Dixie. Welcome along to my all new bonus tent. My show is on the road and it's every land. The cost of this game, two coins in the hand. There are some great prizes on offer today, so come on in and choose what you play. Okay. I can't remember what you win from these. Okay. Cranky gets like very insane later on. Like it, it, it becomes very crazy. But this is, this is a cool minigame. It's like a tug of war, but with targets. Uh-oh. Got it. I forgot what you got. Bananas. Coins, 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 coins. Yeah, okay. Maybe... I just remember spending a lot of time at this tent. I don't remember why. Belcher. Oh, crap. Damn it! Now. Gotta get used to this again. There we go. It's easier to throw it on the way down. Okay, the one thing I will I will grant the GBA version. For a boss theme, this is this is pretty underwhelming. 
I, I will acknowledge that. The boss themes in, in Donkey Kong Country 2 were a lot better. Um, and the GBA version does better renditions of the boss theme, so... Oh, come on! Really? Alright, that's it. That's first well done. And you get the nice flag when you've done everything great. This is the quality of life that I wish the others had, you know, knowing what you've done. Barrel shield bust up. Okay, I love this theme. But I've heard people criticize it. I don't know why, I, I kind of like it. Maybe because I, I just like how chill it sounds, but... The, uh... I don't know, the David Wise replacement for this theme. I mean, it's it's probably a case of just nostalgia goggles. I, I recognize that as like, you know, you enjoy the version you're most used to. And there are people that look at um the two soundtracks objectively, and there are others that just romanticize. Yeah, if it's not David Wise, it's not good. It's not to say either is, is not valid, but to me, this is the theme, you know? Anyway, I took the warp because I just, I just want to get to the save cave, save it, and then we come back and do the stage as normal. I'm surprised I remember where most of these are. Okay. There is one thing I'm very, very worried about, chat. I'm not sure if it's going to make an impact, but like... I can't remember if Super Nintendo games use save batteries in their cartridges. Because this, you know... If it does, it hasn't had a battery changed <laughs> since... Since, uh, yeah. We played it as kids, so... I mean, the fact the saved art is still there is kind of miraculous. Because there were only three save files, my save file got cleared. Because I was done with the game, so... My other three brothers got save files, ultimately, remaining on the cartridge. But here I am, back to claim my save file. I don't know, this, this, this thing makes me happy, man. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> that was an accident. Yeah, I was supposed to throw it at that wall. Whoops. This is why we have start and select. Yeah, look. In my defense, it's, it's like one in the morning almost. I mean, I got to have my save file, it's just, it got erased, that's all. No work tomorrow, exactly. Can we have pancakes? Uh, uh, I don't know. Thank <laughs> you. 
talk about it amongst yourselves in chat, and then if there's enough interest, maybe. Oh, damn it. Oh. It turns slightly. Rookie mistake. It's okay. Got the Lux Kong back. Oh yeah, these things. Bang! Bang! Well, listen, if, if I was to do that, it wouldn't be for like... Because you realize if I do that, a stream ends, right? It becomes a Discord thing. I mean, I do want to play this for at least another 40 minutes, so the VOD's like roughly half an hour. I mean, an hour and a half. Did I say half an hour? An hour and a half at least. Movie length VOD. Wow, I'm getting lucky with this RNG. It hasn't made me cross. There we go. What time is breakfast for me? Breakfast for me is like... <sighs> uh, listen, I'm not getting up. <laughs> if I go to sleep, I'm not waking up until way later. Breakfast for me is either I get up early enough to have it, or it's like I go straight to lunch. It's currently one in the morning, consider that. I would I would want a decent amount of sleep. Oh no, not this one. Ugh. I remember that this one is like There's two ways you do the stage, is either... I think I need to do it quickly first, and then you come back into it and worry about the bonus stuff. Because you, you can't do both. It, it just becomes too annoying. Yeah, basically, if I'm doing that, it has to be a case of, like, I'm staying up, I'll eat, and then watch a movie, and then go to sleep. But if I go to sleep... Odds are I will not wake up until later. It's just, I'm not a morning person. Unless I, I have, like, some commitment. Where it's crucial that I, I get there early and I have to be there early. It's just, nah. Ah, <laughs> uh, just too slow. I gotta do this again. But now, now it's less of a focus on speed, and now I'm gonna aim for the bonus stage. I just can't get Kitty Kong's, um, skip ability right. Like, here, I need to take a hit on purpose. for speed for the DK coin. Oh, 
Oh, this was just a one-up. I thought this was another bonus stage. Well, my bad. I oh, see, I got it. Right. That time. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. What is that? There's still another bonus stage. Because the flag's still, uh, droopy. I'll probably brute force that, that beast thing. Wait, ah, that's what it is. There we go, there we go. Um, I can re-enter it. It's okay. Do this. I mean, discuss it. Come to a consensus. I'll sit here and play my video game. <laughs> and I need, I need this coin. It's sad that all these one-ups that I've gotten are gonna vanish when I save the game. I don't I don't understand why. Why I'm struggling with this. I shouldn't be. <laughs> oh my god. Oh! Alright, got it. That, that was... yep. <laughs> Christmas miracle. That was even remotely uh, doable. Damn it. No. Okay, I got it. DK coin acquired. Wait, so what's the best record for? Alright, I'm curious. What is it for? I want to find out. I thought the best record was to get the DK coin, but maybe not. I need to get better at the, the skippy, skippy move. Well, for the 19, for the old Mario movie, there's like a version available on the internet archive because it's like the the special cut where they take the uh, the scenes that got deleted from it and restore it. So that's I mean, quality's flaky, but <laughs> it's a bunch of stuff that get added to it. I mean, I, I did see that like how long ago was it? It's been a it's been over. It was during the pandemic, so it, yeah, it's been a couple of years. New record, that's it, that's all I got. Okay. Squeals on wheels. I 
genuinely don't remember. Okay, <laughs> it's a lost cause. Might be something that you just do naturally later. I think it's just sealed for the beginning. I generally don't remember this level. In case you don't make it. Shit. <laughs> this, this is gonna. No, come back. I think I think I'm overcomplicating it. I think this is simpler than what I think it is. So glad I have her. <laughs> that would be nightmarish with Kitty. decided anything yet, but I mean, feel free to suggest. Oh, I thought... Okay, maybe not. Wait, I can't swap up here? He's a... Should give you le leeway for one. I always found this one weird because it's like, why would you want to grab unripened bananas? be the only one that thought that. Oh. 
ろう I have to trust that this is gonna work out at the end. Shit. I guess this, this stage was not memorable for me because. It's a lot of, uh, running around. not getting away from me that time. Ah, oh, ha 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 complication. Now we got this. Um, right, I remember this being important. I need to pick you. But this bird needs to survive at all costs. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I think I can get through this world. I think, I think this is going to be fine. Look, it's Knuckles. Sound effects make me happy, okay? anything with this bird. I think I do. Okay, no. Yeah. It's a bonus stage. I thought it might have just been a shortcut. Alright, this one sucks.
You know, there's like a tough time deciding. The easiest way to do it is just... Old school style. Just <laughs> bring up... Bring up a catalogue of movies and then you're like, oh yeah, that looks interesting. It's one of those things where sometimes you don't know what, what you want to watch until you see it, you know? Bang! Can't remember if I need to go purchase the mirror yet. I mean, probably. I know which bear I'm looking for. Is this, is this a thing? I can't remember. No, I don't think this is a thing. It's very convoluted if it were. Hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> Missed the whole letter. No, yeah, it is a thing. Ugh, that sucks. I genuinely can't remember what I have to do. Oh. Well. Okay, I need to go back. Oh, see, this was simple. Yeah, this here. Okay. I don't want to believe that this was the case, but I think it is. Oh. Okay. There we go. Dude. <laughs> this game, man, is, is, is no joke. This is just to get out, but now I have a way back in here. Uh, I think... I, I, please, please... Okay, good. I, I can't remember which one's better. I think it might be a job for Dixie. Yep, it is. Okay. Yeah, that's that was like the vaguest of recollections that that was there. Uh, I do remember having to do these, uh, throws. I don't care about the, the letters. The letters don't count towards anything. I just, I just want to see if this is like a wall thing or not. Crap. Oh, no. Damn it. <sighs> Hitbox. Probably not. Okay, just leave it for now. <laughs> what was that? Oh, 
Oh. K and G. Lux Kong, you're up. Shit. <laughs> there we go. That's it. Aren't I doing well? Um, Brash. I don't think Brash needs the mirror. Yeah. Hey, it's the Banana Brain Kongs. What do you think you're doing coming to Brash Thing? See that riverbank? Oh yeah, ran. Yeah, I beat it. What? You can't have beaten my time. I've held that record for the last two years running. You've made me so angry I could... <laughs> yeah. There we go. Bobbing barrel a brawl. Ah. Yeah, look. <laughs> As always, when I can, I will. This just, this just makes the process easier. Y, Y, X, A, Y. Hooray. Okay. Oh, the boss. Wow, already. It's only been an hour and 15 minutes. <laughs> huh. You know, this is going- I, I get the feeling this is going to be much shorter than Donkey Kong Country 2. Just- just the feeling. In terms of how long it takes me to finish it. Maybe. I know a little bit of confidence right now, and later it's gonna... ...can probably be misplaced. I mean, I'm, I miss Rambi, but... The elephant was versatile. Oh no, this, this was bad. I remember this being bad. <laughs> I remember this being bad. Okay, it does, that's fine. I, I, gotta, I gotta retry. Oh wait, hang on. Do I? Maybe I don't. Shit, maybe I don't. It doesn't... Uh, I can't see any reason why not. No, I'm dead. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, so that's like a... That's an all or nothing situation right there. There's no checkpoint either, I'm just gonna have to... Do my best. That's fine, I just gotta get used to the barrel toss part. You just gotta make a good bridge. I, I failed. It's not a very long stage.
Okay. I can do it, 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 I can do it. Just tank the hit, it's fine. I get another attempt. There we go. Everything is under control. Crap. Eh, it's not like I needed it. What was that? It despawned. I think I... This is something. This is clearly something. No? Maybe I'm wrong. I suppose if anything's missing, it's gonna... Ah, there we go. There's a barrel. Easy, easy. Gotta let that happen. There we go. Oh man. Being all sorts of nasty right there. Okay. Oh boy, it's spooder time. Let's see if I can do this first try or not. Okay, while this is happening, this is the sacrificial lamb. So much easier with Deluxe Kong. Down. 
Hey, first try. <laughs> uh, I do not have all the DK coins. Hold on. What is what is this? I missed the DK coin here. Where did I? Oh, all right. I didn't even realize I did. That's okay. I may have confused the two tree stages. That might be why. I just didn't find it. I'll figure it out. Probably like some something where I have to throw. Most likely. It's just a bonus barrel. I'll know it when I see it. keep doing this. One of them will be correct. Oops. What if it's... No, okay. That's also a possibility. Like a broken floor. I see there, look at that. I can see it from here already. There it is. Oh! <laughs> I don't need to finish the stage. There we go. Uh, hold on. I don't need to save here. Who is this? Blunder. Remind me who Blunder is. I've been watching your progress for a while, Kong. The name's Blunder, but you can call me Mr. Blunder. So, you think you're going to find everything in the game, eh? You don't even know there's a lost world, do you? Whoops, I think I just let the cat out of the bag. Um, yeah, I already know the, the secret. <laughs> it's fine. Patch, oh yeah, this is just what I needed. Hang on, for just a couple of seconds, Kongs, I'll get you a cool new tub for you to rub a dub dub. Time to catch some rays. Okay, uh, I need to purchase the mirror. What is it on this fine day, Kongs? Is that a mirror? Yes, but it's no ordinary one, though. It was Cranky's great-grandfather's, and I can let you have it. I can't let it go for no less than 50. You gotta be joking. Not interested, I'm sure, because I don't think it's gonna stay here very long. Um. Okay, I need to save the game. I just need to get reminded if this saves the coins or not. Cause if it doesn't, ah. 
No, see, this is the one nice thing this game does. It saves your coins. Um, already 25% of the way, by the way. So, there's that. Okay. Two worlds. I think this is a good first part to this, right? It's like roughly an hour and a half. <laughs> a little bit less. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll continue to play this one. Anyway, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh yeah, right. YouTube, thank you for clicking, sticking around to the end. I uh, hope you enjoyed this so far, and if you have, consider button clicking for algorithm purposes and whatnot. So, but yeah, thanks for tuning in.